What's going on guys? It's Neil back with another PHP object oriented programming tutorial and today we're going to be looking at pretty much uh, visibility within your classes and what visibility means is pretty much what parts of your PHP program can see these properties and methods inside your class. So if you look here I've got three properties uh, already defined. One is public, one is protected and one is private. And the difference between them is public can be accessed outside of your class and anywhere in your script essentially. Uh, protected can be accessed by this class, any inherited classes and the parent class which if you're not sure what that means uh, we'll get to that a little later in the tutorials but yeah that's all you need to know about it for now and private uh, allows this to be accessed within this particular class dog but not by any um, inherited classes no parent classes this is the only class that this can be accessed in so let's just try this out now I'm gonna close my class and create a new instance of it by making do dollar sign dog equals new dog. If you're not sure what I'm doing, you can watch my uh, first tutorial, which goes over creating new instances of classes, etc. And if we try to echo dog public text, and I'll save this and go into Firefox. Oh, wait, hang on. Typo, sorry. Public text. So if I save that, go into Firefox refresh I am a public text it prints it out perfectly as I went through in the last tutorial but if I try to print say protected text see if that and refresh fatal error cannot access protected property dog protected text yes so yeah uh, because it's protected it means that it can't be accessed outside the class itself so that's why we're getting this error. It's nothing bad. It actually allows quite a lot of uh, diversity in your scripts, things like that. It allows you to define certain variables as public as you need them to be private for some variables, etc. And the last thing I'm going to look at is using these uh, visibility uh, keywords, public, protected, and private, for functions in your classes or methods. And what I'm going to explain now is if we make a function called show text inside our class and make this print out say a protected uh, a protected variable like protected if I could spell it right Jesus protected text and then call this function text that should print it out all right and I'll explain why in a second yeah I am a protected text now the reason this works perfectly compared to trying to use it outside of the class is because the function is actually defined inside the class so it has access to this text whereas if we tried to just print it out from down here outside of our class we would get an error it works the same with uh, private variables too I do believe so if we try making a line break and then another property we'll try printing private text this time save that and refresh yeah there you go I am a protected text I am a private text uh, so yeah that's pretty much all you need to know about uh, uh, visibility inside your classes and yeah if you have any questions you can leave a comment send me a message just do whatever I'll try to answer as uh, as adequately as I can so yeah 